It's been a while since we last played. Hello and welcome back to War of the Human Tanks Limited Operations. It's plural. <laughs> so, I think this is where we left off. I don't really know. I'm, I'm just assuming it is. Because I went and got my save files from my other computer, put them on this one, and I think that this is where we left off, but I don't even know. And I don't think there was anything I was supposed to do in between recordings, was there? Like, was I going to go back and do crap? Probably was. Looked like I had to do some stuff. Oh well. Too bad for me. We're just gonna move on. So I was reading... You know, sometimes I'm just, you know, the rabbit hole of the internet. But I was looking at the green light thing, because they were like, you know, because the green light's supposed to be cancelled here soon. And I'm just sitting there looking at it and just... It's, it's weird. There was a chapter 11, the liberation of Kusatsu Hot Springs. Yeah. There was this guy who's like a freelance developer and he's just sitting there complaining about like how Steam Greenlight sucked and Steam Direct is going to be so great and blah, blah, blah. And he was just talking about how like, ooh, it's going to take the power out of the hands of parasitic teenagers and stuff. And it's like, dude, you, you sound like such a pretentious prick. Because he even says, like, the way it should be is that, you know, Steam should moderate who is put into the the, the thing. It, should, it shouldn't be in the hands of the gamers and stuff. And it's like, dude, you're acting as though, like, the whole, his whole, basically, the vibe I got was, like, entitled prick. Where he was like, ooh, I deserve to be on Steam. These gamers are holding me back. And it's just like, dude, bro, no one deserves to be on Steam. Like, no one, you know, no one just gets that. You know, that's not, you're not entitled to it. I don't really agree that gamers should be the ones who are preventing people from being on Steam, but uh, the fact is you wouldn't be on Steam anyway, and green lights your avenue to get onto Steam, and if you're not chosen, sorry, tough luck, sucks to be you. You know, like, you don't get to go and rant about it. Sorry, that's not how it works. You can say, yay, Steam Direct is great, but you can't sit there and complain about, you know, about a voting process. Sorry, you lost the draw guy. But then I looked into it, and he was like this really shitty freelance developer. And when I say shitty, I mean he, he, he really wasn't that good. Um, and he is like, on his Steam profile, he's just bitching about, like, how he doesn't want to work with anybody. <laughs> I don't want to work alone, da -da -da -da. And it's like, dude, you are a fucking joke. <laughs> well, there was my rant for the day. Mostly, I just found it funny, mostly. But I wanted to say it. I wanted to say it, I wanted to... Because it was what's on my mind, damn it. Alright, let's continue, though, with this game. We got a hot spring voucher from the HQ, and here we are! But the next thing we get is an is an order from the, But the next thing we get is an order from the kingdom to exterminate stray tanks. They're really good about luring us into these conflicts. Imperial headquarters screwed us again. Now we have to liberate the Kosatsu hot springs. Yeah, damn right we do. I don't even know how long this game is. Seems like they're just hitting us with some random missions right now and we're not really advancing the plot. Which is fine, because the whole you know, appeal of this game was, hey, we're gonna throw random maps at you, that you have random resources. I mean, it's not random, of course. Um, we're gonna put, you know, maps at you with predetermined resources, and you've got to figure out how to make it work. Have fun! So, like, that's what's really the appeal of the game. Just like how the appeal of Alter was Mount Fuji? What was... It's not Mount Fuji. It's the Cavern of Fuji, right? Oh man, I can't remember the name of it. But yeah, that was the appeal of Alter. The actual storyline wasn't really the appeal. Uh, wasn't really much of the appeal. Alrighty, so what do we got going on here? Well, I guess what we should do first is take a look at the map so that we can see what the map says. Mataro is using her rifle right now, so she'll be a frontline unit. Aw, oh, Spats or Nanako? They're both the same. It just depends which one you want to use. Man, that's a tough call. I like both of these tanks. I'll use Spats because Nanako makes me think of... <sighs> of a tank that we don't have. It brings a tear to my... I miss it. Oh. 
Let's see, what do we got going on here? We have a move of four. Muku. That's my only good assault tank? Cool. Good talk, game. Yeah, this isn't gonna go badly for me at all. Scouts, what do we got? Toro. Alright, you're gonna go right up the middle, Toro. Mihari, you take that spot. How many tanks am I even allowed? I didn't even look. I was just throwing crap onto the field and being like, Yup. <gasps> they gave me a good battery tank, though. Oh. Yes. And then throw a Shizuka over there and a Kana in the center area. I'm gonna love it whenever, like, my entire front line just gets obliterated. That's what... The prediction for every map is that my entire front line will get obliterated because it's going to happen eventually. It's just a matter of when. Like, what mission will it happen on? Really is, like, what we're... <laughs> because we've seen it happen before in Fuji, just... It happened a lot in Fuji. Basically, if you didn't have fast enough tanks, they got totally wrecked. So, I have no idea what that save is for, so I'm just going to override it. It's been so long, I have no idea of anything. And obviously, I'm not using bombs, because I just have a horrible, I hate bombs philosophy. I really shouldn't hate them as much as I do. It's just a, it's just a, um... You know, it's a thing from the older games where it's like, I don't want to take something that's going to die because it's, you know, other tanks can carry over. But I can't carry over any tanks, so I really could feel free to use them. It's just I don't really want to. Oh, crap, I didn't read my my notes. Oh, well, damn it. I'll probably lose anyway, who cares? <laughs> Let's go! Who's gonna go first? It'll probably be Hotaru. Oh, an enemy went first. <gasps> oh, another enemy went. <gasps> They're fast. Uh, I'll leave that one for you to take out. Take out this Toko Toko nice and early. Oh, and we get a free Taro. It looks as though they're still on the bomb thing. They were using bombs a lot in other matches, and they're still using them a lot. don't know why the AI loves bombs. I say that as if the AI has any ability to pick its own tanks. <laughs> it doesn't. Alright, scout tank down. This is going pretty well so far. We're annihilating the early enemies. Okay, well, my fun and games have ended. Friggin' Melody on the field. Okay. I'll need my artillery. There we go. There we go. And that takes out that melody. Good work, everyone. Alright, we got another tank marked. I missed that because I was clicking, trying to click on my other tank. No. Damn. Uh, right there. Got another one marked. Got another one, Captain. Can we hit from here? We can. Adios, amigos. Oh, and I got another one for free. Well, how lovely is that? Oh, boy. We're just ripping them to shreds here. I got an achievement. One rock. We're conserving ammunition, uh, sir, I think. Or something like that is the achievement uh, dialogue. But oh no, my tanks! We got attacked by one that came from the side. I should have put my other artillery on that side. I didn't expect the left side to be cleared so easily. Although not necessarily cleared, but you know. Dealt with to some extent. Uh, I really don't think that was where they were, so... I choose... I make the choice not to shoot my own tank for the expectation that maybe there's a thing there. Come on, Taru. There we go. Where are you? Die! 
die for your sins of killing two of my tanks. Hate when you guys do that crap. <laughs> I hate when you do your primary function of destroying my things. How dare you! I really don't want to miss. I can't hit it. This is not going very well now. We're suffering casualties like crazy. I really don't want to move you up, but I'm going to. I'm not going to fire, though. Because there's an achievement for perfect accuracy, and I mean, technically, I have perfect accuracy right now, right? Because every shot has hit something. I hope at least. Oops. Just move up. You don't even have the range to hit anything anyway. Go! Alright, well, we found that. Nothing up there. I'm gonna move over to here. Aw, oh, damn it. She made such a sad noise. Oh, well, whatever. This is with the expectation that I go first. <laughs> Alright, you were right here, so it's right there. Right, so I accidentally won. I kind of figured that I would, but I... Look. I got a rank S. Okay. <laughs> I was hedging my bets that I was in the dominant position that I would get the rank S for it. And I didn't really want to take the chance of getting a tank destroyed. Also, I wanted that achievement perfect accuracy, and there it is! You can't see it because my resolution's too big and it's over in the far corner. But there it is! <laughs> can't I, like, shift tab? Wouldn't that do it? Nope. Nope. Shift tab doesn't do, uh, steam whenever you're... In this windowed game, okay, well fine, Steam, screw you too. Due to the actions of the 4th Imperial Armored Corps, the Kusatsu Hot Springs Resort was liberated from the Stray Tanks. Yeah. But if the Stray Tanks descend on, a, on the city a second time, there will likely be another appeal for their suppression, and we'll get another fake voucher and have to come back out here, thinking that we'll have a good, fun time, only to find tanks here, and be like, oh well, we don't actually get to have any fun, we have to go kill these tanks. Because I doubt the hot springs are open, because the hot spring caretaker is probably like, Oh man, tanks are here, I better go run off for a little bit. I'll come back when they're fixed, uh, when they're killed, you know, all that. Because that's our luck. That's our lot in life. We did it. I should really look at the voice actors for this, because... I'm intrigued by that. So we did that. We're still just hanging around in the Kingdom of Japan's territory, I think. Yeah. A little bit weird. Uh, a little bit weird that we're just hanging around inside of their territory. Isn't it? Just a little bit strange. I think it is. But that's that. I'm gonna go read the, uh... <laughs> the direct, uh, the, uh, you know, the officer's note for that last mission. We got a cleanup request from Royal Army. We can see, uh, we can see large Royal tanks, too. We might as well attack their command tanks up top. Alrighty. Alright, back to what we're doing. Let's see how long we've gone. It's probably only been, like, 15, 16 minutes? 15. About. It's 14, actually. I have a good eye for numbers. I don't know how long the next mission's gonna take, though. It could be one where it takes me, like, friggin' forever. Who knows? We'll have to find out together right now, instead of stopping the recording. So let's go to the next episode. What will be awaiting us here? Worthingham Tanks Limited Operations. We had a different title screen. Oh boy, could that mean this is a special match? Chapter 12, The Scouting Battle at Mount Akane. Hey, this is where the treasure was.
This is where Alter found a treasure. It was a bunch of helmets. I remember this. Commander, we've received reports that the remnants of the New Japan Alliance Army have taken refuge on Mount Akane. They've ordered us to search for them. And while we're at it, exterminate any stray tanks in the area. There are a lot of stray tanks, aren't there? Those stray tanks seemingly used to belong to the Alliance Army. There could be officers of the army hiding somewhere around here. Limit clear condition? Who knows? Good talk. Let's get rid of you again. Alright, Hotara, what are you carrying? Your rifle. I never get a say in what you bring. You just bring whatever you feel like. I kind of wish you would let me have a say in the matter. But whatever. You do you, Hotaru. Well, I'm gonna win the battle. <sighs> I'm the best. <laughs> Limit clear failure. I'll have to redo that, and I'll redo that in a bit. While exterminating the stray tanks, the 4th Imperial Armored Corps conducted their search for the remnants of the new Japan Alliance Army. However, they found no signs of the enemy. It seems the Alliance Army had retreated into hiding in a different place altogether from Mount Akane. Or it could be Akane. I don't know. Well, whatever, I don't need that to save. Alright, let's try this one more time on camera, and then that'll be it. This is a bad idea. That right side's gonna have to pick up some slack, because they got a lot of work to do over there. Okay, so I, I think, okay, I, I really need to check this. Yes, barely, but yes. Okay, so that's one artillery tank down. And I think that we actually got to move before they even had, were able to set up interceptors, which, haha, <laughs> sucks to be you guys. Oh, I hit an interceptor. <laughs> Interesting. How very fun. No scouting, just attacking. Let's go, team! Whoa! They killed their own guy! They sacrificed her to take Hotaru! No! You bastards! Alright, we have to set up an intercept, so let's see, where do I want this? Yep, figured as much, only four spaces. Completely not helpful. You better shoot where I intercepted. Damn. <laughs> well, okay. Uh, I don't want to use you for this. No scouts for you. You knock that crap off. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Let's see, boss it down. We can start moving in towards that 
one horrible tank that I hate. Who will blow me apart. Not in the center. I can't hit anything. I don't want to just take a random shot because there's no point in doing that. Because I'm not going to hit it. This is, I'm playing a dangerous game. There it is. Alright, it's going to probably have interceptors guarding it, but let's see what we can do to it. Oh, we got it once. If I can get this guy to move, I can finish it off. Go, Gonta! Do what you were made to do! Oh, wow, you, you kind of suck. Hmm. Gonta, be a distraction! <laughs> You're more valuable that way. Now watch there be a interceptor blocking my path. <laughs> Aha! There wasn't. Also, I almost walked too far and had to would have had to shoot myself, which would have been hilarious. But you know. All right, taken care of. We know there's another command tank. We just don't know where it is, and I don't want to accidentally hit it because what if I have to kill all tanks? Who knows? We know that there is. Well, that's a shame. We know there is one tank up there. But I can't see it, so let's see if it's there. Yep, okay. I was gonna, I was saving my artillery for it, but you know, whatever. I don't want to blow myself up for you. I'm being a little bit picky. I should stop that. See if we can get eyes on their command tank. Yep, she's in the back. I can't hit anything, so I'll stand by. Alright, let's see what they chose to guard. Do we want to... Alright, here's the question. Do we want to bank on it being kill everything? Or do we want to bank on it being dominant only? I'm gonna just say kill everything. Because right now I don't feel very threatened. I think they only have one more interceptor, one explosion, and that boss that we just saw. Explosure. Good good word. Where is it? Somewhere back here. And she's guarding the other one, so... I can't reach, damn it. Alright, I'm running out of time. I'm just gonna have to... You know, just do it. I should be able to retain dominance, so that's not a big, uh, fear. But it's gonna suck, there's... I think only two tanks left. Looks like it. Emo war? Okay. I don't want to do this then. I could provide the distraction. But even then, I wouldn't be able to kill it. Alright, I'm going to hope that it doesn't, uh... This isn't gonna work. That one doesn't have enough move. That was a waste. Ouch! All we gotta see is if this one can reach it. I don't think it can. Yeah, that's right. It can't. Oh, you moved, though. Why, thank you, you stupid idiot. You could have just stayed still and you would have been fine. I wouldn't have been able to kill you. You dumb dumb. Oh, boy. Where was I standing that I got shot at? 
Well, fire randomly until we hit something. Uh, I hit those three. There we go. Voila, massive victory. Destroyed everything, got my limit clear. S rank, there we are. Bada boom. So that's it for this episode. We're apparently going to the Arctic Territory next episode. Yay, that's gonna be weird.